Alright folks, we're back again for the second part and continuation on the Nikon FA and the Nikon MD15 motor drive. Okay, first let me finish this off. Uh, when you're, uh, the Nikon FA film camera, right, uses Nikon lenses, AI or AI lenses, uh, also E lenses as well. Okay, how can you tell AI or AIS lenses? Is that they have those little numbers okay one on the top for you and one on the bottom for the aperture direct readout okay so it reads the scale through the window okay if you're wondering where that window is it's right underneath the camera right there okay and then you just attach the lens as such like I said AI AIS or E lenses and now that's all perfect okay now when you have your film in there, you look it, when your film is loaded, and you crank it once, and you look inside there, and you see a little C250. If you see C250, that means um, it's 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 new, it's fresh, it's a fresh negative. So you fire it once, you crank it second time, you fire it second time, third time, and then you'll see that it goes from. C250 to the actual ex, um, the actual shutter speed. See, in the shutter speed, this is the uh, shutter speed indication illumination window. That right there. Okay? That's right there. And you'll see that in the inside. If you see C250, it means it's not right yet. Okay? Now you see the shutter speed. Okay? But after you crank it three times, you got to remember to pull the negative back and how do you do that by pull it by rewinding this okay and it just makes it it, it won't rewind it completely it, it because that button hasn't been pressed so it just tightens it up so it's nice and taut okay so that means you get a nice clean image in each frame so now now we're going to go on to the MD15 motor drive Okay, I have one right here. It's in excellent condition. It's really nice. All the grip is tight. There's no looseness. You know, just got a couple of light scuffs on the bottom of the base. Yeah? But it's really nice. It takes eight AA batteries. Okay? And now, you have to make sure that the motor coupling device, it, you know, it, the motor coupling is lined up properly horizontally because you can't have one being vertical and the other one being horizontal it just won't work okay them two have to line up can you see that yeah yeah and now and then make sure those eyelets are out of the way too as well and then you attach that gently tighten it up by thumb rolling this yeah Make sure it's tight. Make sure those eyelets didn't get caught between the uh, camera and the uh, grip. I mean the drive. And then there you go. Now you no longer need to use the crank. You don't need to do that anymore. It's not necessary. Okay. You'll see that the motor drive is in L position. Okay. That doesn't mean like. Okay. It means lock. <laughs> You push the silver button in and you turn it to single mode. Yeah? And you get a Yeah? Yeah? And if you want to put it into C mode, C mode, <laughs> C mode, that's continuous mode. See? That's the sh that's the shutter speed indicating that this is the window which a lot of bright light so it's fast and that's shaded so it's a little bit slower okay so next thing I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a picture of this flower okay folks all right uh, my settings is ISO 200 and uh, I've got it in aperture mode so that means I'm gonna look through the uh, to get a, a direct readout and I got f8 as my aperture and f8 and 1 30th of a second 
That's what I got showing. I got 130th of a second in F8. Whoop! Still got in continuous mode. Let me. Anyway. Now, I'm going to take my. I'm going to take this lens off. So it's the same lens. I'm going to attach it to my trusty Nikon D200 camera. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm going to put it in manual mode. And uh, let me see. All right. Yeah. I got it set on f8 and 30th of a second. Okay. So f8, 30th of a second. You see that? Uh, let me turn this on here. Let me. Okay. The last picture I took is a picture of Dunkin' Donuts coffee cup. The cup. Dunkin' Donuts coffee cups, right? That's my last picture. Menu, ISO setting 200. Okay, a non CPU lens is a 24 mil f2.8. Okay, you see all that, right? All right, let's go and take our picture now. F8, 30th of a second, and I'm going to focus that in and Bingo bango. And look what we have. Look at that. Wow. See that? Awesome. So, there you go, folks. This camera is spot on right. You can't go wrong with this camera. Nikon FA camera. Test it and everything. We got ourselves a winner here. I'm going to leave it right there, folks. Uh, if you need any more information, let me know. And let me know how uh, you like this uh, video. I'm going to let it go there. Guys, take care of yourself. Be good. Be good to yourself and stay cool. Later.